it's a, it's a great question. Um, no. From first round draft pick, then becoming Uncle Drew, Kyrie Irving changed the NBA landscape with his moves. With LeBron, he became an NBA champion too. I'm going to discuss where he might go. So give a like, comment down below what you think the Cavs GM will do. Enjoy. LeBron is a very demanding guy, and the Cavs have traded every little asset they have to win a championship with LeBron. They had Deion Waiters, Andrew Wiggins, and others. And guess what? They lost. Rumors are being speculated that LeBron is going to leave next year. So why would Kyrie Irving want to stay on a team that has zero future? The answer is he should not. He wants to leave now and pave his own legacy and not just be a shadow of LeBron. Part 2. Where could he go? Now this is where it gets really interesting. Kyrie Irving requests the trade. The big keyword there is requested. So I hope you know they do not have to honor this. But I think they will. Just think about if they didn't though. LeBron will be posting this Snapchat story after a bad game. But for them to trade Kyrie Irving is going to need the help of Cavs in the future, but also right now. And that's tough. The Cavaliers have received offers from six teams, but the teams want to know if Kyrie would want to play there because who would want a player to get traded to a team and then two years in the future for Kyrie to not sign the extension? It'd be worthless. So the Cavs were interested in Josh Jackson, but the Phoenix Suns said he was not going to be traded. So now we go to the Miami Heat, who today denied any offer to the Cavs. Me personally, I would like to see Kyrie go to the Spurs, Knicks, or the Timberwolves. Without any other leads, I'm going to predict two teams that could possibly trade for Kyrie. The Boston Celtics could trade Isaiah Thomas, Jalen Brown or Jason Tatum, and a couple draft picks, but I still can't see that happening. So let's say the Pelicans trade to Marcus Cousins just for Kyrie Irving. That'd be an interesting one, for sure. So as I wrap up, Kyrie does not want to be in LeBron's shadow no more. He wants to get out of Cleveland. So in return, the Cavs want a young player, a veteran starter, and a draft pick. It will take time to find this, and it will probably be a multi-team trade before the season starts. This was Daily Dose of Sports. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, give a like and subscribe down low. I hope you have a great day.